my passion yeah, is, the passion behind that. you know, I'm a journalist like you. So I always say that we flirt, we journalists flirt with that idea a lot because we cover it and know so much that, you know, sometimes we feel that we know more than even the politicians because we're covering the whole thing. Sure. So I said that has some part on it. The other part of my grandfather from my father's side was the governor of the state of Zulia, which is the oil area, mm -hmm. the original oil area in Venezuela. So I think you have something, there is something in the DNA. And then what happened to Venezuela? Well, it's very important to me. See a country that has it all, very rich, the more stable democracy in the region, the richest country in the region, fall in the hands of socialism, what a, socialism and communism for me is the same thing, and be completely destroyed and, and, and see the people starving uh, and, and dying out of starvation and lack of medication. So I know it can happen and we used to say, oh, it's not going to happen to us. When people start to say, oh, it's going to happen like Cuba, oh, no, it's not going to happen to us. Well, you know what? It did happen. And then I saw how these countries started to change. I've been here for almost 31 years. And I've been seeing how these countries started to change. And this, you know, the similar things, how mm -hmm. our country in Venezuela started to change. And I'm like, no, we need to stop this before it happens. Because you want to be involved in that process. Yeah. Yes, and I learned that people tend to think this is politics and it's not me. And the way I see politics is we all need to participate because it's about us. <laughs>